now you see how to find the commutation relation between the different uh, component of angular momentum like x l x l y l z and the position x y and z in the commutation relation between a and b is a b minus b a and the commutation relation between a comma b c is yeah, commutation relation between a comma b and c plus b into commutation relation between a and b. Now we have to find out the value of Lx commutation relation between the angular momentum component and position. So first we have to find out the component of angular momentum. So L is equal to R cross B. Uh, you know how to find out the angular momentum. So it is L is equal to i j k and x y z and p x d y p z in the matrix form. So we can write L is equal to i y p z minus z p y minus j x p z minus z p y x plus k x z into x p y minus y p x. So the component along angular momentum component along x is y p z minus z p y and y is z p x minus x p z and angular momentum component along z is x p y minus y p z. Uh, now we have to take the commutation relation between L x comma x. So L x you know it is y p z minus z p y. So the it can be written as the commutation relation between y p z and x minus the commutation relation between z p y and x and so if you use that formula like uh, a b comma c uh, we can uh, write the these two as commutation relation between y comma x into p z plus y the commutation relation between p z and x minus z commutation relation between p y and x minus the commutation relation between z a and x and p y is equal to uh, here the first term is 0 the second term is 0 uh, because p z comma x is 0 commutation relation between p y and x is 0 commutation relation between z and x is 0 so this term is equal to 0 similarly if you do it for uh, instead of x if you do it with y so the commutation relation between Lx comma y. So if you do this, um, we can get only one term like uh, commutation relation between Py and y that is equal to minus ih graph. So we are getting the term is ih graph z. Similarly, instead of y, if you do it for z, that is commutation relation between Lx and z, we can get the commutation relation between y comma z pz plus y commutation relation between pz and z minus z commutation relation between py and z minus commutation relation between z and z py so here also the first term are zero second term we have the value that is minus ih graph so other two terms is zero so only you have minus ih graph y so here, if you use uh, Lx with x, y, z, you have the term for y and z, not for the x. Okay, we have the value. Similarly, if you do it for uh, the angular momentum component of y and x, y, z, if you do like this, uh, you are getting uh, the commutation relation between y, l, y, and x is i h cross z and commutation relation between l y and y is 0 and commutation relation between l y and z is i h cross x. So it is like a, a, a cyclic commutation. So if it is l x and l x it is 0, l y and y the commutation relation between l y and y it is 0, commutation relation between l y and uh, l z and z it is 0. So uh, other term is like uh, if you do it for z term, L z and x is i h plus y, L z comma y is minus i h plus x, and L z and z is zero. So it is like a cyclic permutation. If it is L z comma x is means i h plus y. If it is uh, L z comma y means it is minus i h plus x. 
so similarly if you do that you can get the value thank you